Microsoft customers today typically deploy Microsoft DNS as their DNS platform for Active Directory. The primary reason for this is because it's built into the wizard. It automates the process. Unfortunately, what it doesn't do is give all of the capabilities that's available in a enterprise grade DNS solution. We also hear that they're concerned specifically about support related activities from Microsoft support. And then finally from migration from the Microsoft DNS service to a third party DNS service. However, even though that wizard exists to make that process simpler, it does not necessitate the need to use Microsoft DNS. And in fact, if you have a DNS infrastructure already in place, it is very possible to just point your existing infrastructure at that DNS server for all of the necessary updates and changes to be made to the DNS zones so that Active Directory will start up, all the records will be uh, listed inside of that zone, and the configuration process can move forward. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna now dive into each of these in just a tiny bit more detail. The first issue that we hear about the misconception related to using a third-party DNS system has to do with the fact that the Microsoft DC Promotion Wizard integrates the configuration changes into the Microsoft DNS server. What Infoblox can do is actually provide the platform for these services and it integrates directly in with Microsoft. The second issue we hear is about whether or not Microsoft will continue to support the Active Directory environment even if DNS is on a third-party platform. The reality is Microsoft not only has knowledge base articles specifically referencing the ability to use third-party DNS systems, but they also have many customers who leverage an Infoblox platform as their DNS platform. In fact, you could call Microsoft and ask them what type of support they're going to provide, and they'll tell you that they will provide support for Active Directory, however, they will work with Infoblox support and you as the customer in order to troubleshoot any DNS related activities. The third issue that we hear from customers has to do with how do we migrate data from Microsoft DNS over to Infoblox DNS. Fortunately, Infoblox has a significant amount of experience not only performing these activities through our professional services team, but we've also integrated a lot of the steps that can be used for simple migrations directly into the tool itself. With that, we've provided a capability to rapidly move data from Microsoft into Infoblox DNS and ensure that the full support and capabilities of not only what's necessary at the protocol level are there, but also expand upon and add a significant number of additional features. Now that we've addressed not only the misconception related to whether or not you can use a third party system, we've also briefly talked about support and migration related uh, hesitations as well. What this does is it provides the capability for you to consider having a discussion with Infoblox about the technology that we can provide and the value that we can provide should you consider moving in the direction to enhance your network.